So thanks to you guys, this like uh, study trip happened. So we really appreciate it. Let's go. Thank you for this opportunity. I uh, this time I would like to talk on the side of understanding the yes. autonomic nervous system. The first uh, autonomic nervous system is not something invisible. Yeah. <laughs> associated with uh, various uh, physical symptoms. It's an essential perspective for treat humans. Learning about the uh, NS, autonomic nervous system, will change your clinical practice. We research for uh, NS or physical therapy, uh, we find uh, cardiac rehabilitation and uh, autonomic nervous system relationship and it's probably reason and uh, ANS so uh, respiratory more ANS system yoga and meditation and autonomic nervous system uh, research increased recently uh, clinical effective uh, but little evidence, uh, combination that uh, therapists feel connected to in clinical practice, but uh, little evidence. Today's thoracic flexibility and sympathetic I talk yours. Thoracic flexibility and sympathetic, uh, do you feel a connection between the two? Thoracic flexibility and sympathetic. Do you know? <laughs> yeah, the nerve is located in thoracic joints, so that's why. I feel ribcage problem and NS disorder. Case with atopic dermatitis, twenties uh, range, neck or decollete and upper body. In this case, alignment and mobility of the ribcage sitting position and try her flex uh, trunk, uh, but her cannot flex uh, trunk, no flexibility. So let's check, uh, bring your forearms together and flex your back. The uh, checkpoint is where, where the, your elbow Touched your stomach? Yes. Yes. It's a big stomach. No. Big stomach. Are you com compensating with hip flexion? Uh, is there any imbalance in the uh, roundness of your back? And then, thrust is check to place your hands behind your neck and bring your elbows towards the city. And side bending. Can you? <laughs> Checkpoint is your elbow on the opposite side beyond the center, center line. Are you compensating by flexing or rotating <laughs> your spine? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is your roundness the side of the ribcage natural? Ribcage. Sympathetic nerve problems, uh, hyperactivity, uh, hypertonia, uh, chronicization of inflammation, sleep disease. Disturbance, constipation, coldness, <laughs> coldness, <laughs> is to get irritated, sweating a lot, hyperactivity, uh, sympathetic and parasympathetic. Today is sympathetic. 
sympathetic drum is here. It's here. The stiff rib cage affects the movement and function of the sympathetic drum. What problem does it cause? Autonomic nerves, the nerves. What is the state of the nerves that cause errors in electrical signals? What is the uh, ideal state for nerves? Uh, what affects the wax of nerves? Tissue around the nerves, bone, mass, mass, so fascia, ligaments, but Internal organs, skin, nerve flexibility, nerve flexibility, as well connective tissue, endothelium, perineum, epithelium, epineurium. Epineurium. It's difficult to say. Yes. Yeah. Hard to pronounce. It's very hard. <laughs> Blood circulation in the nerves. Uh, blood flow of nerve is very important. Artery is, of course, nerve inside in arteries. And blood flow is very important. Uh, what affects the work of nerves? Uh, what do you think is necessary to maintain these three? What do you think? It's difficult. Uh, if we replace nerve uh, to muscle, what affects the work of muscles? Tissue around the muscle, uh, flexibility of muscle or fascia, uh, blood circulation of the muscle. Uh, nerve to muscle. What do you think necessary to maintain this? This question is easy. <laughs> Exercise. Contraction, relaxation. What affects what's now? <laughs> what do you think necessary to maintain these uh, nerves? What do you think? Stretching and relaxation of nerves. But uh, nerves cannot contract and relax on their own line. Muscles. How to stretch and relax? Movement. Movement. Stretching and relaxation of nerves associated with uh, joint movement. Influence of the work of the NS, sympathetic high four activities. The two little nerve stimulation. Now this use. <laughs> Decrease flexibility of the nerve due to fixation movement down. Blood circulation for failure of the nerve. Uh, electrical signal do not transmit pro company program. Uh, electric signal reduction reduce. Sympathetic hypoactivity, sweat ground function down, uh, dry skin, uh, the deterioration of artery. <laughs> Correct? <laughs> Correct. Uh, and then, sympathetic high power activity, too much nerve stimulation, compression, stretching, intensity, uh, frequency. Increase electrical signal, increase sympathetic nerve activity, 
ไปบ้าง Oh, this is the activity of blood vessel contraction, blood flow down, coldness, constipation. What movement are needed for the leakage? Drum. Slack movement are sympathetic drum. Can you image <laughs> right side uh, sympathetic block, left side? Mm -hmm. Right side is stretch, stretch. Uh, left side is relax. Necessary movement for the NS uh, actual elongation mm -hmm. and relax. This is very important. These two movements of the spine in the direction of gravity are uh, essential. Relax it. Case with atopic dermatitis. Uh, case introduction. Uh, atopic symptom. Neck, arms, deferring, uh, and even just the air condition breeze cold. Pain and the uh, itching is also strong. Uh, evaluation of rib gauge, cervical bed, bone break, one, two, three. Uh, hardness mo moderate. Thoracic bone break, one, two, eight. Hardness no. Clavicle scapular pain, pain move. Uh, evaluation two, uh, tenderness, uh, TH4, and seven. Spinous process, star, none. Circumference. Circumference. Less Sympathetic inhibition of sweat glands, face and neck. T one two four. Upper ribs T two nine. Hardness of thoracic vertebra one two eight and cervical decline upper ribs. The the area with reduced swelling. The area with atopic dermatitis have matching spinal cord levels. Main problem is uh, decrease swelling function of the upper body, decrease mobility and flexibility of the rib cage, and, and so on. Innovation, intervention goals. Increase mobility of the ribcage. Intervention method and pro progress. Mobilize mobilization to the entire ribcage. And independent practice of moving the ribcage three times uh, by five to, to ten minutes per day. Before and after two months. Uh, consequences uh, in each thoracic vertebra one to eight. Destruction of flexion and lateral flexion may remain, uh, remain. Uh, significant improvement compared to the past. Clavicle no pain, uh, scapula no pain when uh, ascension. Expanded movement of the rib cage during breathing. TDH4 and sternum pain remain. Tendency to reduce. Be good. Be thick. 
these four and oh, sorry. <laughs> after two months. Yeah. <laughs> nice work. <laughs> nice work. Nice work. <laughs> this slide is uh, last year uh, I presentation and presentation in. The Japan Society of Autonomic Neurology. Uh, the effect of spinal movement in HRV is simple. Heart rate okay, okay. by the blood pressure, heart rate changes. The uh, method uh, spinal movement exercise group, uh, no exercise group. Control group, and spine relax, and chair sitting uh, and moving, moving, and relax for uh, five minutes. Measured. Movement, move, movement is flexion and extension, and side flexion. A rotation. Each performs five round trips uh, according to the rhythm of the sample video. The exercise for the total about eight minutes. Uh, skip. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. So I <laughs> Discussion on fluctuation in HRV. Uh, HRV decreased from Im immediately after exercise and with the uh, a passage of time. This decrease of observed even in the control group without exercise, suggesting that uh, posture change between sitting and supine position apart from exercise uh, may, may have influence difference in HRV. This exercise load did not provide clear data uh, showing change in heart rate variability. This exercise are load or that does not cause blood pressure fluctuation is it is suggest that the heart rate may be lower than before exercise. Fluctuation is in, in NS stat status and measurement values. People with a dominant sympathetic nerve system tend to have less variation in the measure, measured uh, parameters before and after exercise in this study. Uh, people with an overactive uh, sympathetic and parasympathetic nerve system tend to exhibit uh, greater HRV fluctuation before and after exercise. It seems necessary to consider exercise by type of autonomic nerve. Even with uh, manual intervention, uh, I feel that there are risks associated with uh, applying the same intervention without assessing the autonomic nerve system condition. Ignorance uh, of the autonomic nerves also increase the risk of worsening symptoms. Regardless of the orthopedic central nerve system or type of disease, uh, knowledge of the AMS is essential to the uh, evaluation and intervention of humans. And other animals. <laughs> uh, do you have such a patient? Uh, people with do not go well in rehab rehabilitation. And people who deviate from the protocol. People who have many problems other than the diagnosis name. Does a patient have any these symptoms? Symptoms not problems. A high there are patients like this. If you think 
evaluate and in the way in the new age. Thank you so much. <laughs> gotten thinking because I know of some patients like that and we don't really think about looking at the rib cage. So now maybe I could ask help from Fumi <laughs> and learn from his courses if he teaches it in English so we could help our patients more. <laughs> <laughs> I have a question. A uh, three thirty-five slide number three thirty-five. Uh, yes, yes. Uh, I think uh, before after it is very changed. Uh, so I think you try home program. You try home program. Mm -hmm. I want to know how type home program. Home program try. Yes. This movement. And uh, breaks and rotation. Uh, right elbow is opposite. Oh, opposite side hip from the hip. This movement is home program. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> How check you program? Uh, my niche is that how to check it. 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 Exercise and post the right message. She sent you the video. So you can check. So you can check. So you can check. So you can check. So So you can check. 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 So you patient went to you because of the neck and back pain and you treated that patient for the rib cage uh, because of the uh, the uh, other symptoms uh, the redness of the neck Aww. or more on the pain her why did she go to you uh, at first Pain or pain or the skin. skin. Uh, 
Okay. She can for other vampires. Ah, uh, okay. Not, not, not for the name. That's just uh, symptoms. But me, she's referred for PP because of the atopic, atopic dermatitis. Yeah, because this place is named uh, mm -hmm. Arcor. Arcor. Mm -hmm. For allergy. Allergy. So that's why I like, I like the user friendly name.薬はほとんど使ってなくて、ただ保湿はきちっとやろうねって話で言ってたんで、でもこう最初の状態だったら本来は薬使うべきだよって話もして、使わなきゃダメだよって話したんだけど、どうしてもそこは嫌だっていう
type of mobility uh, in uh, are associated with uh, autonomous number system dysfunction. Mm -hmm. so, so, so do, do, do you know about it? Or in your clinical experience? <laughs> uh, so, uh, uh, high flow mobility area, do you think about uh, more, more, more like that? <laughs> はい、はい。あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ、あ
あったのとあと他の人のリサーチとかも見てるとこうどうでしたかこの痛みたあこの動き痛みありましたかって言ってそれに答えた発声だけでも変わっちゃうっていうのが分かってだからでもその研究はすごくてちゃんと発声のタイミングをずらしたらそのスパイクがなくなったっていうのでそれはだからその前にやってたいろいろが全く無駄だったっていう結論なんですメンタル的な状況だったり、前の日に、まあ、細かく言うと前の日の睡眠とか、何飲んだか何食べたかとか、直前にどうしてたかみたいなのまで関わっちゃうんで、確かに難しいは難しいです。だからつって手をつけないわけにもいかないから、僕はどっちかというと臨床視点で、患者さんができることとか、患者さんが実際に訴えていることをよりこう研究して、もっとちゃんと大学で研究している先生とかに、N 数を増やしたやつをやってもらえるようにしたいなって,って問題提起だけでもまずはいいのかなと思ってちょっと穴だらけの研究ではあるんですけどやりたいなと思って続けていく全然英語できないよ<笑>いや、最近思うだったら、ベスターチャスマイスマイポイントビュー、and then、uh, he was talking about the point of the view and he wanted、uh, uh, Reports to the researchers the,、um, the like, clinical proposal. The, it, this kind of like, clinical perspective is very important, and then、uh, hopefully, in the future, the researchers、uh, can have more solid research. But when it comes to the nervous system, just saying something or eating something, they're、uh, really, really easily affected. <laughs> so that's why it's really, really difficult to. Um, it's not that I'm pure there, but he wants to do、uh, the research because、um, that's really important to scrub some better. So that's why he wants to like, propose、uh, not doing like, solid research, but he wants to do some proposal for the future. So. I have a question. <laughs> I think that the Adobe has many. Variation. So, how do you set short time goal, long time, long time goal? How do you set with the woman? How do you talk about? In this case, in the s o l yes. Yes, 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 yes. こうティッシュをこう貼り付けてきたので最初でこうこういう感じで動く力むち打ちの人みたいにしか動けないそういう状態だったからまずはちゃんと寝れるっていうのをショートタウンボールしてまずこの寝室液出ないような状態を持ってきたよねでもそれこそ無理に運動できないんですよ痛すぎて終わるだけで痛かったなのでまずはここやってお辞儀しなくてもいいから手を合わせるようになりましょうみたいなのやってここの少しずつの動きだけどやりすぎるとパキッて割れて寝室器がもっと出ちゃうだからそういう状況だからだからこそさっき言ったその薬が使ってほしかったんだけどそれを選択しなかったりするのでまずはこういうふうにゆっくり動かして寝室器がだらだら出ないようになって夜寝れるっていう状態をゆっくり作っていこうって話で、まあ、前半で途中からその乾燥した感じになってたのであのアクティブな動きをたくさん入れてるっていう。アクティブで動くっていうのはいつぐらいから始まるの1か月この人最初の頃は週1で来てたので最初の3回4回ぐらいはもう次の日の様子とかこの新世紀の状態なので寝ない程度になって少しずつこう首もこうやって動かせるようになってきたからちょっとローテーションも入れてみようかみたいな感じでやってたから。And this question was like, how do you decide、uh, the goals? Yeah, especially in her case,、uh, she had infusion because a lot of the arthritis. So that's why he wanted her to use uh, the, the uh, medications so that、uh, not to cause the cracking、yeah. here and then more infusion because of movement. So that's why he started the, the exercise, just taking the position first and then gradually s l o w i n g And then, like a month later,、uh, she could start to、um, move 
more actual frequencies on the layer, and then gradually forcing it the exercise.最初の方に私いつ治りますかみたいな結構鋭い質問とか根的なやっぱ統合を伝えるっていうかやっぱ治りますよって言えないものもあるかなと思ったときとか結構僕の患者さんにはなくても僕の治療を受けて直後はちょ
気を止めてることないですかって言って、まあ、本人に言ってもまず気にもしてないかもしれないあとはこう噛みしめてる食いしばりがある人も結構いるのでそのやつは結構ほとんどのケースに言うか硬いタイプは緩くてっていう人には言わないけど硬いタイプの人にはちょっと呼吸どうでなってるかって言ってますだよく学生とかだったら隣の仲いい親友の子に呼吸止まってるかどうかをこう気にしてって言ってもらうように頼んで家族がいれば家族だしちっちゃい子とかだったら親にいるし本人じゃなかなか気づけないとし周りの人にちょっと頼んでおいてっていう説明は最初にしますその例えば緩い人とかはそんなことはないんですか緩い人緩い人気はない人はやっぱり赤くいない可能性っていうああそういうこともないあの逆にあのスタビリティがなさすぎてっていうこともあるので今度交感神経の働きが減弱してしまうとかあのハイパーだけじゃなくてっていうのもあるのでだそういうこうどっちかがいいってことじゃないダルダルモーターダルダルで起きてる人もしかもそ,のそれが大体その体幹の上の方が硬いけど下が動きすぎてるとかそういうこともあるので同じ人もなる。中間位で固定させるようなスタビリティのトレーニングの方をねちょっとそんな激しい動きじゃなくてこここういう姿勢でやりながら上身をちょっと肩回してみるとかなんかそういう体幹を固定して他の四肢の動きをさせるみたいなトレーニングあのコアスタビリティ上げるようなトレーニングっていうよりももっとレベルの低いっていう言い方が確かに簡単なやつからやらないと全然ガチって固定してやっちゃう。Thank you for being here.